limited if I do get into this. And then there's ray tracing, in my, which my TV can do. See, I'll click day pass. And see, it'll ask me to scan my phone, which I'm not going to do. So I'm going to exit out. But the fact that it put the movies down here, my last channel that I was signed into, it's got a bunch of movies down here, the games. It's got a bunch of um, little things of like prequels and sequels and stuff to stuff that I don't even know how this got here. I didn't look at any of that, but I guess it just was featured or whatever. It's just, I like this little banner up here also. When you click on it, um, it's like start a new experience. You can go to apps and then when you click apps, I mean, this isn't new, but you can add, it's quicker than just going to the store. But I guess the store is just what they have preloaded now. But the fact that when you click on it, everything what you watch will, you know, show up. Like I've been watching superhero movies. So, of course, I don't know if this is how this is, but... You know, these these two popped up right here because I've been watching superhero movies for the past couple of days. But um, this is just a phenomenal update that I can't get enough of. I, I am really enjoying these options. Jurassic Run. I thought this was... Um, something else i forgot what the name of that game was the guy the game where that little shadow guy runs from the spider and you have to do all these different things to get away from stuff almost like out of this world from playstation i mean out of this world from um at the snes that's what i thought that was um this is just it's so many so many options that I could go through that I probably don't have the space on my phone for. I'm using, for you, for people that's also asking, what am I using to upload my YouTube videos? I'm using an LG Velvet, which does uh, native 4K, but no HDR. Um, I'm trying this video now in HDR. So if it uploads in HDR and I tell you it's not HDR, forgive me. Um, I'd rather say that it's not something, but then if you look at it and you see it later, you're you're not, you know, too upset that I lied. But I, that's why I try to be more as specific as I can. If this video uploads in HDR, that's great. If it doesn't, it's still native 4K. Um, that's that's about it, you know. I just I'm really enjoying this, you know update this is one of the best updates i have seen in forever you see i can also get updates from apps too and i only got one you know i didn't because i didn't add any more see the web OS. this is all of that's got that i want to update i don't care about updates from disney plus and youtube and twitch and all this other stuff <clears throat> but i also have these little options, um, the multi view, when you go up here, the last thing you use will be up here. I think that's how that works. I haven't figured this out completely because I've used multi view before and it just shows up multi view, but it doesn't show you the apps you use, which I only use the PS5, which is my HDMI 3 or the YouTube. It's always that. Or I've, I've not clicked on, I don't know if you could use app. You know what? Let's try this. Let's just try this so I can clear some air. This way, if I know I can do it, I'll try it. So we're gonna power on a PS5. HDMI 1, HDMI 2, HDMI 3. And over here, we are going to try a movie app. No, I cannot click Disney Plus or anything. Just YouTube is plethora is plastered all over this little bar. So apparently I can't use any movie apps. I can use the web. There's a camera. Okay, apparently there's a camera I can connect to this TV. 
airplane i'm guessing this is something for my phone yeah i'll do this later okay apparently i can't use this i can't use disney plus if i can i just like i said i haven't figured out how to do it yet there's probably a lot more stuff that i'm missing so if i missed anything go ahead and you know let me know down in the comments i really appreciate you guys um thanks for the also two followers that i got i really appreciate you guys like i said um, i'm not doing this for follows i'm not doing this to up my channel or nothing i'm just really i like really uploading videos because i mean it's it's something i do for fun something that people ask me about you know and i usually upload videos if people ask me you know um they say dude what do you know about the like like the tv what do you know about the tv update this is an update i was going to do anyway but somebody else asked me too down in the comments as long as two other people on my playstation friends list which is awesome so that lets me know you guys are supporting me which i appreciate um but like i said i I'm not into it for followers. I'm not into it to, you know, try to see how big I can blow up. I'm doing it for fun because I like doing it. It's awesome. Um, follow me. Don't follow me. It doesn't matter. I'm really, I just really enjoy you guys enjoying my content because if, like I said, if it wasn't for me, a lot of my videos wouldn't have views. Um, and I got to read out um, a YouTube feedback list where one of my videos got 27,000 views. And I'm like, 27,000? I thought it was a glitch. I thought it was like something wrong. When I looked at it, my video had 27,000 views, 25, 27,000, something like that, in the 20,000s. And I'm like, who watched my video that much but didn't subscribe? Like, I don't care about subscribers, don't get me wrong, but that was still phenomenal to me. I had never had, none of my videos have 27,000 viewers, views. So thank you guys, like, so much for that. That really, like, kind of hit me. But that's that's way uh, way more than what i expected it to be and it's 456 i gotta make a run so thank you guys for coming i appreciate it this is draven rain phoenix signing out if you want to know my youtube or no my, not my youtube my playstation id it is raven phoenix r-a-y-v-e-n-p-h-o-e-n-i-x thank you guys for coming i appreciate it you guys be safe and stay scared